Hey y'all. Today I am building a house in The Sims 4, but I am only using game packs. All right, first let's start with the actual floor plan. Here is the general shell of the house. I think it's pretty cute. I didn't really want to extend the back too much. So I don't know if I should like make this look more exciting back here, but like the front looks great. I gotta scoot the house back though. Cause it is like right up on the sidewalk. Nice. Okay, so here's the fun and exciting part where we go to packs, select all game packs. First, let's start with the columns. Cause I want to put one right here. It's bothering me. We actually have quite a few really good ones. I think I'm going to put some like trim on these. Okay, I don't want it to be too big because then it sort of sticks out like that. But the skinniest one is this guy, which I don't mind. I make it white. I wonder if it would look better if I just used like this. <laughs> and this one goes all the way up. Okay, personally, I think that's better. So I guess I'll change that column too. Let's add a spandrel situation. We've got some pretty cool ones. Is that like too much? I think I'll go with the more subtle one. I think it's cute. I'm gonna lift this up onto a foundation. That's what I have to choose from. That's not what I want. No, you know what? Put that sucker back on the ground. <laughs> I wanted to use bricks. Okay, that looks all right. Let's go ahead and put this on. And then I wanted some siding right here. We only have this like vertical one, but that's fine, I think. Oh, that looks so good. Maybe I'll make this down here. Yeah, yeah that looks better. Okay, that's looking good so far. Let's see if we can add like doors and windows and like a patio flooring here. I think I'm just gonna have to go for like a, if I have a stone, <gasps> can bring it out as well. Oh, they even have this like really dark one. That might be too dark. We have so many good options. Oh my goodness. Look at that. That's pretty too. Personally, I'm really really liking that one. Okay, let's go for that. And then for doors and windows, let's see. For the front door, we've got some okay options. We also could do a medium size wall since that is medium wall height. So we've got some options here too. Like, oh my God, I may have to use this. It is just so beautiful. I think I'm gonna go with that. So for windows, oh, you know what? Actually, wait, go back to doors. Um, I am going to have a back door, I think right here. These are also from game packs. So I did not cheat. I, think I might put a little single door right back here. Okay. So for windows. I'm really hoping we have some like full length ones because I have a vision here with these bay windows. I have a vision. <gasps> okay, that's not really the vision. <laughs> Beautiful, but okay, hold on. If I flip it around, this will work. And then on the inside, is it gonna look weird? That's not that bad. I think that's fine. You know what? I actually really like that. I think it looks cool. As for the colors, I could sort of make it blend in. Does that change the color of it on the in- Ooh. I don't know if I like the brown window on the inside. Maybe once I put more white windows, it'll look evened out. So, okay, let's see if I can find good white windows. These are pretty nice. I like the shutters a lot. That's a contender. Oh, we've even got little shutters. I think I might have to put this round window up here just because it's amazing. Oh, look at that one. Look how pretty that is. I don't know what the heck to do for windows up here. These windows do look like a little puny. Like in the grand scheme of things, like they look a little sad, but I don't know what else I would do up here. I mean, there's these windows. Those don't look too bad. Okay, I think those are gonna be the best. And please tell me that there's some good, oh, Oh God, there's not that many good window boxes here. <laughs> you could make them white, but honestly, I think brown could be nice. I feel like this round window is so big. It's like taking over. Maybe I should move it to like here. Wait, that's cute. I think the shutters up there are really, really cute. I'm still torn on this window. Oh man, these look so weird. I don't know what's making it look so weird. Everything looks weird here. Do you know what I think it is? This needs to come down. I like that. This one's funny because it's like no wall. It's just like straight open, but I mean, for aesthetic purposes, I think it looks good. The only thing is that it's hard to put something up there that doesn't look weird. What if I put a light? That could work. What kind of outdoor lights do we have? Hey, that could work. It's a little puny looking, maybe a bigger one. How big do we have? Yep, none of these are huge. Okay, do I cover it in like ivy? I think that's okay. I feel like that's actually a good compromise. I can even bring it down a little bit here. I like that. I think that looks better. Okay, great. Let's move on. Doing the rest of the windows. That took me way too long. Okay, I've got windows all over the place, literally everywhere. They're in kind of random spots on the outside. There are different heights, I just realized, because of the way that the walls sit. I could bring these down. <laughs> This window, it looks so goofy. Maybe I can put something in front of it so it doesn't look so funny. Yeah, the window, it's hilarious. The windows are sitting so low to the ground. If I move them up though, I'm scared you won't be able to see them. You know what, it's all right. I think it's fine. Okay, that's better. They just look so, oh, what about this one? Yeah, I think if I put a little window box, yeah. 
god that just makes everything so much better i'm gonna put them on every single window oh yeah it's all coming together so as far as landscaping goes we don't have a lot of options oh this is a good tree maybe we can put that like on the side and then for landscape Bing. Ooh, slim pickings. I could maybe use these to like line the pathways. That's cute. I like that. I mean, I don't know if I should do this. I don't see what the point of that is. Unless I put something in the middle. Ooh, grass. I don't know. Yeah, I just don't know all that. I don't know. It's all too much. I think that's good. As far as terrain paints go, we actually do have a dirt. Gorgina, love it. There is a mailbox from a game pack. It's the werewolves one. Personally, I think this is actually a really cute mailbox. I don't know where to put it though. I'm thinking I put it like towards the front of the house. I kind of want to like hide it because like it's not the most attractive mailbox. So we gotta be honest. I'll just squeeze it over there. Well, before we go inside, it might be nice to have like a bench or something. Our options are slim, but this one's really cute. It does sort of block the window though. Maybe I have it like by the tree. That's kind of cute. I need a nice outdoor light. I actually might put it like on this column and I'm gonna put some over here. Gorge and there too. Okay, also let's put them outside in the backyard. Oh, I guess I could do the back. Backyard. Let's just take these same stones and sort of just bring it around. We'll just do like the same landscaping. There we go. It looks lush, doesn't it? A little too lush. Okay, time to finally go on the inside. So I have this like tiny entryway. These are all from game packs, all the arches and stuff. Very extra, very extra. Am I gonna have to use actual lighting instead of my go-tos? All right, cut me some slack. I am going to cheat and use these instead. Can you blame me? They're the best. What's a girl to do? She must cheat. <laughs> All right, so let's start with flooring and wallpaper. Oh, we've got some nice flooring. This is one of my personal faves. Maybe I'll change it to be like more ashy colored. And then for bathrooms, hey, we've got some pretty good choices. I mean, these are just like so safe to use. Couple of bathrooms, nice. Now wallpaper is where I'm a little bit afraid, kind of scary. We could go something like really basic in here with that one. We could go grandma chic. God, isn't that so cute? I just love a granny wallpaper, I do. Could go hella bougie. Our choices are slim. I definitely know Oh, I love these vampire wallpapers. Like they are so cute and they will work great in these bedrooms upstairs. Oh my gosh, I totally missed these. These are fantastic wallpapers. I totally missed them. Yes, okay, okay. I'm gonna use that wallpaper like a lot. So I mean, go ahead and just brace yourself. But all the swatches look really different. So I think we're okay. Okay, I guess that's gonna be a really fancy room. I don't know. Oh, maybe this should have the fancy wallpaper. Cause like, look at those windows. Okay, maybe for this room, I do something a little more neutral because it's like quite a big space and then I can bring that upstairs and then I can take the granny wallpaper and put it somewhere else because I do love it. Maybe I'll put it in here. Maybe I'll use it in this bathroom as well. Okay, I think that's all the rooms. So let's start in this entryway because I think it's going to be the absolute easiest room to do. Good selection of paintings actually. Dare I say we have some of the best paintings in game packs. Shocking to say, I know. Okay, got a painting there. I think I'll put a matching painting over here but like a different print. I honestly don't think I can put much else in here. Maybe a rug, if there's a good one. Oh, rugs is gonna be tough. Maybe I size that down. <laughs> These are funny patterns. I mean, they're really cute, but they're like so random. <laughs> what about that? That looks any better. Let's do that. Okay, so this is going to be the living room. First, let's see what our curtain situation is looking like. Hey! These are not bad. So what swatch do I like here? There's not any, <laughs> not a single solid swatch in sight. So that's fun. Maybe I just go with the one that's like the most solid. I could add like one of these in here to break it up to like add some color back in. Just to sort of make it look a little bit more custom. Maybe I should make these more pink. So for a couch, this one's pretty nice. For a love seat, I know there's not gonna be a matching one. I'm liking this one. It doesn't really match, but like close enough. Also, do we have fireplaces? Yes. Okay, all of these are amazing, but I'm gonna go with- Oh no, wait, am I gonna have a TV? <gasps> no, I don't have TVs! Oh man, digital scrolling clock. Y'all ever use that item? I've never seen that item in my life, but I'm using it today. We're gonna pretend that's a TV, all right? Use your imagination on this one. You know what? I actually have access to a sectional sofa. Maybe I should just do that, and then I can make it however big I want. Actually, you know what I never thought to do? Was just like make a love seat. Oh no, it's too close. I could just make a matching love seat. Come on. How have I never done that before? It's almost embarrassing that I never thought about that. I do not know. 
know what color to make this couch. I'm thinking if I just do white, I can like put a nice rug or something. Oh wait, no I can't because we don't have like any good rug choices. Okay, that's not too bad. Scooch that over, okay. It's very neutral. That's more fun, we could do that. In tables, hey, these aren't too bad. I love this one, really big. <laughs> really just get it in there close. Do we have a good lamp? Oh, lots of cute lamps. Well, I mean, I don't know if I would say cute, but like lots of unique lamps. Cannot go wrong with candles. Plants, we have a whole, oh wait, that's a kit. I was thinking of the plant kit. I was like, oh, I'm gonna have so many good options. I do not. These are super weird options. This plant's great though. She's a good one. I did forget about a coffee table. So let me go back and get that. These are okay, not bad. And then for decor, I don't know. I don't know. It may have to be something really random like that. Oh wait, what if I did like this little pot of sticks? I don't really know what to put in this corner. The only thing I can think to do is a lamp, which seems a little bit silly seeing as there's a fireplace right here. Maybe I could do like a lamp and a chair. Lots of good options here for chairs. It's kind of cute. Back here would also be a good spot for like a chair. I didn't think about that. Dare I say it's an even better spot? I don't know, but it's like kind of big. What can I put back here? You know, a piano would be great, but the only one I have is this one. And you know what? I think I'm gonna use it. Oh, it is a gorgeous piano. If I could find a nice rug to put under that, I'll be so happy. My hopes are low. Could sort of do something like this. I don't know who, I don't think people put rugs under pianos. I actually really don't know. I've never had a grand piano. It seems like it would be impossible to do though. <laughs> like how hard would that be? Oh, no way this came from a freaking game pack. I love it. Sometimes I forget. Let's get some paintings on the walls. This is perfect. And over here we can put maybe some like portraits. All right, I think I'm done with that room. Let's move on. This room, okay. I don't know what to do for these two rooms. I'm gonna make one an office and I'm gonna make one a bedroom, but I don't know like which one should be which because they're both pretty. This one's obviously stunning. I feel like this should be the office. It's just giving like office vibes, but I don't know how I wanna like, lay it out. Do I wanna put like a couch right here or do I wanna put a desk? Oh, you know what? I have an idea. What if I put the desk in the middle here and then two chairs? You know what I'm doing? You know what I'm doing? I might use these chairs again just because they're pretty elegant. Like I really like these like patterns they have. I actually like the green a lot. Could have them sort of like facing in like this. Ooh. Oh, these are my office chairs. Those are really sad. You have a better one. Like a dining chair would be better maybe. I'll use a normal chair. I don't have any computers, but I do have a laptop. It looks really puny on the desk desk though, like so puny. Oh my gosh, this is like the perfect item for this room. You better be joking. Okay, I think I'm gonna change everything to like a darker wood. As dark as this one will get, which it doesn't match, it's bothering me. Could do that one. I need a nice big rug underneath this. <gasps> I mean, that's huge. Let's size it down like a little bit. Whoa, these are not elegant. Except for that one, it was boring. You could always size one up. It's just massive though. It's like too big. I do love the green though. Then I could change this. I'm thinking I need a lot of bookshelves in here too. These are my options. Okay. Whoa. Okay, there are giant ones, but these click together like a puzzle piece. And I really like that. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. Let's get some curtains again. I don't know how I'm gonna do curtains on these windows or if I even want to. I actually don't even know if it's possible though, unless I did something like this. But like, I don't know. It like kind of messes it up. The windows are so pretty. I don't wanna mess it up. I do wanna put something Thing under it maybe, like a table, like an accent table. Is that even a good idea? Should I just stick with the couch? Maybe I will. <laughs> Forgive me if you see me use this couch like 50 times. It's like the best one. Okay, we definitely need some plants in here. I'm thinking like lots of plants. Like I want all of those. Bouquet of flowers from a special someone. I like this object. I have no idea what it's supposed to be, but I just think it's really pretty. Some desk clutter. I think that looks nice. And honestly, I think I'm done. Let's move on to this room. I'll make this one a bedroom. <laughs> this is gonna be kind of hard because all the rooms have like such crazy wallpaper with prints on them. I gotta like chill on like the bedding. I actually love this lamp. So I'm glad that it's an option. Nice painting above the bed, a rug. This is going to hurt. Actually, I take that back. I like that in here. I'm kind of liking the like peachy color with the blue. Not typically what I would go for, but I kind of like it. All right, for a dresser, a lot of realm of magic. They have so many objects. <laughs> Again, I'll probably 
probably be reusing lots of different paintings, so don't get mad at me. Put a little plant, maybe some clutter. That's kind of good clutter. Curtains, you already know the ones I'm gonna use. Nice, that really elevates the room, man. Curtains make a big difference. I'm gonna use my handy dandy mirror. I guess I'll use it over here. Maybe I'll put like a plant next to it. That's cute. Oh, this is kind of fun. Cute wall decor. This chair is great, but the swatches make me mad. <laughs> be angry. There we go. Little sitting spot right there. I don't know if I want to put anything over here. You know what I might do? Oh no. I was gonna put an easel. I don't think I have the option. I mean, I do have the telescope, but like kind of in the way. Well, okay. Guess that's not gonna be an option. You know what? Maybe we just move on. <laughs> Let's just get out of there. All right. So this is going to be the kitchen slash dining area. I'm thinking I'm gonna do kitchen on this side and then like a little round table, like something small, or maybe it can fit in a normal size table. I don't know. As for fridges. All right. Looks like we're going with this one, the smart fridge. We have lots of good cabinet options. I love these cabinet options. This is always my personal fave. I love this deep green. I use it all the time. So I think I'm gonna not use it today. I never use this one. I didn't even know it existed. It has a tile countertop. I don't know which one to use. God, maybe I will use the green one after all. I'm gonna do it. I think that looks nice. Okay, I think I'm gonna put like a little half wall right here. <gasps> There's no freestanding sinks. Oh boy. I mean, I could change out one of them for this, which seems dumb. That's dumb. Is there like a matching one? What's that from? I don't actually think there's even a matching one. Maybe I don't do that then. Maybe I can sort of like, God, I can't bring it up. Are you joking? No, that looks so stupid. Oh my God. This is like so heartbreaking. Okay, wait, wait, wait. It just doesn't have that like back piece. Cause like that doesn't look too bad. You know what? I'm just gonna have to go with it. All right, let's do some upper cabinets. All right, I think I'm gonna put the stove here. Got some nice bar stools at least. That's good. I'm trying to look on the bright side. No microwave. Awesome. We do have a dishwasher. I guess I can put that in. Put some tall flowers in the corner to fill up the space. Nice trash cans. Really excellent. No, I'm not putting a trash can in here. Get me all you want. I'm not doing it. Let's add in this little dining area. Again, I don't know if I should do like a small table or a big one. I could do a big round table. I underestimated how much space I had. <laughs> how many chairs I can have. There's so many, dude. I mean, okay. Can I get a nice round rug under that? I'm gonna make the rug a little smaller. Put some flowers on there as a centerpiece. Okay, I like it. Now I have this Big, long wall. What to do? I can put a big painting over here. I think it's gonna be a lot of big paintings. I know I use that in there, but God, it's such a good one. Okay, I could do this. I could put this here. I could maybe put two of these together of the painting above and then like try to put stuff on it. This is gonna be tough. I do not have a lot of good options. <gasps> I had this plant the whole time. Oh, that changes everything. I love that plant. That's my favorite. Okay, going for a symmetrical look here for some reason. Maybe I should have like flipped it. <laughs> sure, I don't know. Can put some skateboards right here. Fun. We can put this like tapestry right here. Okay. Oh, we have to do the bathroom. Oh man. The plumbing is probably like some of the worst. I do like this though. So it's not all bad, but like, look at this toilet. We also have this one. I mean, it's a nice toilet. If you're into toilets. Not a bad shower either. I do have this object, which actually fits in that spot like a glove. So that's perfect. I also have this object. Also perfect. How are we doing for mirrors? Okay. That'll work. I'll use Use this as a towel. The bathroom is going okay. I don't think there's any toilet paper, but that's fine. Oh good, I'm glad those curtains just chop right into everything I was doing. That's cool. Put a painting above here. Oh, pretty, love the gold. Honestly, to be honest, what else can I really do? Put a rug in the middle of the room. Sure, I guess for the bathtub. Okay, I'm done with that. Let's go upstairs. Right off the bat, oh my God. <laughs> can I raise that up? I can't, I can raise it down. I could put it down. I will accept that. I actually kind of like the yellow. That's so goofy looking, isn't it? Oh, Wait, wait, I thought that this would look weird for some reason, but it doesn't. It looks fine. In fact, I might as well just go ahead and put these curtains on every window. Okay, so for the hallway, I'd like to put some activities or something in here, but I don't know what to do. I could put a chess table. That's pretty cute. Love these paintings. What else can I do up here? Oh, I never put railing on the stairs. I guess I didn't really need it because it's kind of like tucked in here, but I'm sure my Sims would appreciate having some railing. Definitely having some right there. Okay, <laughs> that's better. I guess I can put Put, like a painting up here. I do also have this like really long painting, but I, I don't know if that's like, that's like overkill. Like, I don't think we need that. I think right here I can just squeeze in a plant. I think that's fine. I'm gonna put in a love seat right there. And then I'm going to put a lamp. I was gonna put a rug there. I cannot find anything that I like. So I guess that's not happening. That's fine. How about some hearts made out of wood, baby? I'm running out of ideas.
ideas. A boat. All right, I'm done with this. Let's move on to this bathroom. Okay, similar layout to the one downstairs because I liked it so much. But up here, I might try to do like a double sink. How nice does that look? And then, oh, two round mirrors. Pretty. Plant over there. Actually, I'll put it next to the toilet for funsies. Let's put this painting above the toilet again. I would like to have a big round rug maybe in here. Actually, no. Wait, this could be cute in front of the sink. Oh, that's cute. Okay, above here can be a nice colorful painting. I might change the swatch of this. Not really feeling that one. Here is a hand towel for you. I don't think there's a big hand towel. I haven't seen one. It's very possible I've overlooked it though. I've looked at so many things. I think I'm done with that. Let's move on to this big bedroom. It's huge. Where's the bed gonna go? I guess like right there in the middle. Okay, two end tables and a bed. I think I'm gonna go with yellow. Yellow and blue do go together. For a dresser, oh, there is a good spot over here, but it blocks the window. And you know what? I'm gonna do it. <laughs> and just like that, I've decided. Obviously we need this mirror. I'm putting down the collage painting again. I'm sorry, you can't stop me. You know what? I might actually move this over here. Here's my plan. Chair, boom, right? Okay, hear me out. Desk, here, computer, a nice and not ugly chair. Maybe this little moon lamp and some flowers. Uh, I also, speaking of lamps, did forget to put lamps on these. So let me go back. A couple of lamps there. I need some clutter for here. One there. That looks nice. Cheat some flowers on here. Okay, cute. I think I'm done with that room. And moving on to the final room, another bedroom. <laughs> Should I do a kid's room for this one? Bunk beds. They're so cute. All right, I'm gonna squeeze in an end table underneath there. Which lamp should I do? I could do the moon lamp again. I do love that thing. Um, I think I'm gonna try to get a rug first before I do anything else. Oh my gosh, these colors are so bright. Oh, that hurts my eyes. I'm liking the rainbow. Oh wait, do we have dollhouses? We do have this. And this thing rocks. I'm trying to figure out where to put it. It's also huge. Is there no dollhouse? I'm devastated. There's no blarfy either. Oh no, no, wait, there is one. <laughs> that would have been it for me. Okay, maybe I'll move the rug over here. I feel like it just suits it better over here. We could put one of these play tables. Okay. Man, as far as furniture goes, there is not much. We do have a activity table. Oh, that's cool. This could be cool like on the rug actually. I think I prefer that. And then we'll have that in the corner. And I'm not gonna lie. There's like nothing else for kids that I can put down. I mean, there's like projects, but like they're incomplete projects. Man, game packs, not for kids, not kid friendly. You kids like plants. <laughs> I bet you do. This is so sad. Okay, maybe we could do like a couch because this is really sad. I'm, I guess I'll do yellow. We'll do some fun colors. Man, there's like nothing fun. What am I gonna do? Just make a living room for the kids? I mean, I guess that's what I'm doing. Rug number two. I guess I can put this in here. That's kind of cute. No fun decals really either. I guess there's like a moon. Those are kind of cute. I guess the owl will work. I've got some trees. That's cool. I think I'm done. That was a bit of a disappointment there, game packs. I was a little disappointed. Pointed. But okay, there is my house. Um, we have lots of empty space in here. I most definitely could have made this a little bit more narrow, but you know, sometimes you don't know until you get in here and then you're like, oops, my bad. So what do you think? For only being able to use game packs, not too bad. The only thing that really irks me is this kitchen thing, but I think even that looks all right. I think we saved it. And I think the outside is really cute. Probably one of the, my most favorite houses I've built in like a while. What happened to the columns? Oh my God, they vanished. Well, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Hope you're having a wonderful day and I'll speak to you all very, very soon. Bye-bye.